I am Pat Biernick, Director of Development here at First Light in Ketchum, Idaho. Today we are introducing the Foundry Collection into the market. We have taken proven fabrics and design and created a new selection of pants. Paul is wearing the corrugate foundries. One of the items we do here at First Light in order to get into production is fit. That's one of the big ingredients, fit and function of a garment. Um, what we do is, first of all, get a base model. We measure the important things. Number one would be um, the hip, the waist, knee, thigh, calf, and then after that, we'll grade it out to the other sizes. We keep in mind that we will have different body types during the graded size run fit sessions so that we can make sure that it fits different body types even though you may fall in between different sizes. We keep in mind the location of zipper placement, toggles to make sure that it's quiet in the field. We also, in this particular pant, we have a knee pad. We want to ensure that when you are in the field and you kneel down that it's hitting in the right spots. Another item that we always keep in mind um, when we talk about fit and function is the articulation of a pant particularly. You can see from the side view how the patterning is angled slightly and that will just allow for a more of a functional fit when you're in the field. We also put in these side vents that will allow some airflow. We are also introducing this pant with a fitted waistband or numeric sizing. So when you purchase them, it will be just the same way that you'll purchase a pair of blue jeans. We feel like we can dial the fit in a little better on a numeric fit. Uh, my name is Paul Peterson. I'm the social media manager here at First Light. For reference, I'm 6'1", buck 90, 33, 34 uh, waist in pants, about a 33 inseam. So these are the 34, 35. Uh, I got to use these a ton last year, starting in August with archery antelope into January with archery deer down in Arizona. High country mule deer, sheep hunt, all over the country, probably put like 75 days in on them. I love these pants, they're super versatile, they're super feature rich. Rigid waistband, super solid, extremely awesome when you're packing out weight. I usually run the belt with the pants as opposed to the suspenders. Works great with either, it's just a personal preference. Dual. Um, Cargo pockets located on the front of the pant as opposed to the side. Awesome for stashing things you need quick access to. Uh, able to secure more valuable things that you don't want falling out if you're moving quickly in these zip pockets. These side vents, these are extremely handy when you're gaining elevation, generating a lot of heat, or in the early season when it's just hotter outside and you need to stay cool. They also feature removable knee pads. Um, if it's warm, I usually don't run the knee pads. Later in the season, they're great. These are super easy to just slip out, pull out the bottom. What's cool too is you can run a gaiter under these knee pads if you want. I personally don't love the fit because you get a little bit of a bunch here, but it's still functional. I prefer to take the knee pad out and run the gaiter if, if the weather, the conditions warrant the gaiter. These knees and the seat, um, they're waterproof. So super, super nice for a wide range of conditions, no matter if you're kneeling down, sitting down, whatever it is wet, snowy, nasty conditions. These pants are just going to do a better job than any pant we've created at keeping it dry, comfortable, and keeping you in the game longer. Callum is in a size 32 of the Obsidian pants. We keep in mind different body types while we're going through the prototyping process. This particular pant is in numeric sizing, so purchase it like you would a pair of blue jeans. We have a rigid waistband, We've got the stretch nylon in the high wear areas, which would be the crotch gusset, the lower leg, and the seat area. I also want you to take a note here of the knife gusset we have on the side, which is really a nice feature. We also have a double-sided cargo pocket with crown sliders and a toggle. Another item we wanted to highlight uh, on these pants, a sub-assembly, is a new suspender design and attachment. It was designed so that it's very functional when you're wearing a backpack or a waist belt. You no longer will have a pitch, pinch point at the center back and it will be attached here with a, a gatekeeper that comes easy off and on um, if you don't want to wear it. This is a new design and we really think it's going to enhance the product. 
I'm Calvin Dickerson, I'm the e-commerce manager over at First Light, and I'm just gonna walk you through the Obsidian Foundry Pants. I had the opportunity to use these for spring bear, fly fishing, and early season hunts. Like one of my favorite features is actually the rigid waistband. Um, compared to our standard Obsidian Pants, um, this is gonna provide more structure, especially when the pant gets wet. Um, like I said, I spend a lot of time fly fishing in these, which might sound odd, but just kind of water testing and see what the fabric would do once it was saturated and how fast they would dry. We've got double-sided cargo pockets um, on the outside of the pant. So for quick access stuff like hats, gloves, um, backside, but electronics, um, more valuable things, bullets, that kind of thing, goes in the zippered side. Um, overall, they fit really well, especially in the quads, and there's plenty of room in the calf as well. I would say that these work great all the way from pretty much springtime bear hunting all the way through rifle season elk if you just throw on the right base layer. This is a hoppy American style. I <laughs> saw that. That looks kind of interesting, doesn't it? It's good. <laughs> it's even better that it's 1030 in the morning. Callum is our size 32 model, so a little slimmer than previous model. We use... <laughs> <laughs> A less dr drinks less beer. <laughs>